sprayer and minimum amount of tools if you see I have a stucco sprayer an air compressor and a cement mixer now that drum mixer isn't even necessary if you have a handheld uh, mortar mixer you can mix your cement up in a big bucket and they actually will mix better than a cement mixer this is meant more for concrete if you got your cement sand and aggregate to use cement and sand alone, this is not the best mixer to use, but it is getting the job done, but it's a little more problematic than a handheld mixer. So either way, the point is, you're looking at very minimal amount of tools, very inexpensive. What you see right here so far is between yesterday and today, it's a total of six hours. It's actually under an hour for today so this is less than an hour's worth of work for this part so imagine now if this were a 30 footer you know one or two hours and you're talking about a, a massive dome structure you could build really inexpensively and you're gonna see I'm gonna finish this dome off for everybody so let's walk to the other side and I can show you something there on this side what I'm, sh I'm demonstrating to you is the form to make this you can't get any simpler if you do please let me know but all I did was I have a pallet and a few pieces of masonite board that I cut into thin strips in fact if you recall these are the same masonite board that I use for doing the foundation ring beam I removed that wood and recycled it to make this archway so it was really at easy inexpensive way to make your form your arch i don't have to bend any bars to make the shape you just simply make it and you can see this is going to be solid once it cures i'll put another 
mesh layer on tomorrow and all of this will be all blended into the dome structure making it all monolithic making it all one cement dome now the blower I'm using to inflate the air form is a bouncy house blower I have this blower available on my Amazon link so you can check in the description box below the blower is under a hundred bucks it works much better than a leaf blower I've used leaf blowers in the past but they'll burn out the motors because they're not really designed to be running for days on end sometimes now this blower it's under a hundred bucks and it'll run for days I've had this blower running for like a even a nice seven days straight before when I was building the larger domes to inspire you guys to build your own domes I'm putting my online workshop course on sale from now to the end of September so that you can all go learn for yourselves how to build a dome the online course is 15 hours teaches you everything from the foundation to the air form to the reinforcement I go over everything it is as if you were here for one of my nine day workshops it's the same thing you're gonna have all the information plus the new information I add when I'm finishing the interior of my domes I'll be adding to that course so you'll automatically have any updates that I make to it so again from now to the end of September to inspire you all I'm having this sale on my online workshop course go to aircreteharry.com for your online workshop course that's it for now uh, I'll be back tomorrow working on the dome I'm gonna try to make these videos the, the same day I record them so today we got this done and tomorrow I'll be it may be finishing up the whole thing with the spring so anyway that's it for now this is Aircrete Harry peace out I love you all and I'll catch you later